what? Ow! I'm coming down! I'm coming down! There I am! Alright, now I'm back again. Hey everybody! Rebellion here, and we're going to go back into Makai Kingdom. Normally you'd see me in the actual game right now, because normally I cut in the middle of the episode and then you guys see the next one, but that last episode actually ended there because I was in the process of moving, but now I have finally moved! I'm here in this open room! My TV appears in the corner, and in this corner it's just... I'm surrounded by cables and computer parts, and... No, I don't want to see that. This bag here full of water bottles, with my iPod's charging. Some leftover spare change, and over there, for the rest of the hallway, is just all my stuff scattered around, so I'm gonna have to deal with that. But I have to sink right now, since I'm probably gonna end this chapter right now, and if I have time, go to the next one. I'm on new game! Click, click. Oh, wait. I don't even have to do that, I'm on Bandicam. I'm so used to actually having to do that. <laughs> well, let's go and continue. And episode one. Pages of Tragedy. Oh, we got a Smokey with us, and quite a few of you guys actually wanted to join. I was honestly surprised by how many people asked to join, because I thought for some reason none of people would show up, but my god, you guys did. I just finished going through the comments section, going through every single request. At this point, I'm not going to accept anymore. If you commented right as I'm doing this, I apologize, but man, you're out of luck. First, we have the Swordmaster named Ronin who was requested by Vayne Ryu. He wanted it to be made by something that increases attack, so I'll figure that out. A fire mage named Crimson by the request of Jai's Lightseeker. I am sorry, butchering your name. Next to the healer named Snoopy from Tilkem, wanted to be made out of flower. A pickpocket, you did not say what kind of name you wanted, by the pers by the good friend Tweeper123 from a palm tree. A witch called John from Expressed Life, wanted to be made out of flower. A warrior slash apprentice, I think I mixed up on that one if I actually had to write a slash right there, named Wyvern from the Dragon Rune. He wanted to be made out of a rock. Witch named Lena from Mega Man X111 wanted to be made out of a flower. A female a warrior slash apprentice asked by Luna from Lunar Shadows. Hey, I remember you. Hi. With made out of something that increases defense, I think. You said you out and you need some defense, so I guess you, you're saying you want defense. Next, a carrot dude. I did not even know you could become a carrot in this game, let alone a playable character, but. Alright. From, uh, that's gonna be called Kill Nuss, requested by Matt Ford. Next, a pickpocket called Unreaper, requested by Chase Tanner, who wants to be made out of a palm tree. Next, another pickpocket. That's wants to be called Alice by Kisa Satoma, who requested it. Wants to be a palm tree. Made out of a palm tree. Yeah. An attack mage? If that's a class? Oh my god, I kind of want it now. By, you did not say whatever name you wanted, also. By Dark Slayer J. Wants to be made out of a flower. A thief? By Iceberg. I don't know if they're the thief class. I think you might have to be resorting to pickpocket on that. By Iceberg, who was requested by Iceberg69041. And this person gave me a blank slate. Just any class from uh, that's gonna be called Dusk. And the name it was requested by White Lightning Bolt One. He asked to be a rock, so I'm assuming he wants to be made of a rock. So there's that. Next, this person, huh? They want to be a priest, preferably, or an archer. So we'll see how that goes. I might have to evolve them or reincarnate them in the future. Name Kyrie from Kaname Yuki. Wants to be made of a palm tree. And the last one, you asked to be a Prinny first off, and then a female Swordmaster second. I'm not sure if I can do that, but I will do what I can. If you're a Prinny, Blitz, if you're a female Swordmaster, Ren Rena, with... This was requested by Blitz Star, mind you. Made out of a rock for Prinny, I guess. Tree for female Swordsman, and the stat... You actually gave me stat display that you wanted, so that's actually kind of nice. Makes me less have to do the thinking part and just two part. Now, you have all been given numbers 1 to 16. Brandon.org. And let's see, I will randomly generate between numbers 1 and 16, and who is the first one? Number 16. Who is number 16? Blitzstar, welcome to the team. Let me go ahead and make you actually, can I make a printy? Oh god. Okay, that's actually, I didn't know that. Actually, I had the ability to control that. 
I'm gonna assume that I'm gonna make a pretty right now, can I? Not in the slightest. So I'm guessing I'm gonna make you a female swordmaster, which would mean a palm tree. Though I don't think I have it. I have something to work toward, alright. So, oh dear god, I'm so far I only have one character. Shit. Next character. And the next person will be number 10. And number 10 will be a pickpock. Will be the pickpocket unreaper, Chase Tanner. Welcome to the team. And you said I want to be made out of a palm tree, so we're using the palm tree anyways. Let's see, I'm going to mark right here that who got in and who didn't. So you are in. And then also the Prinny. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We're going on the list. There we are. Yes, I have a method to my madness, and it's called Notepad. Let's see, do I have a pickpocket? Pickpocket, there we go. So the pickpocket unreaper. Unreaper, made out of a tree. And you did not give me any stats preference, huh? But you just said you wanted to be this with a tree, so... I have no idea what pickpocket to start good with, so let me see your stat. You're good in HP and SP, intelligence, tech... Wait, what's tech? I have no idea. I know what HP and SP is, so I'm gonna put one in that. Why not? And then since tech has 100%, I might as well put one there, see what it does. I have no idea what you're good in at all, so... Go with it! Unreaper joined the party. And... I still have to make another person? Oh, great. Since the pretty female swordman can be made, technically I have to make another character. So, we're actually gonna take three people in! What do you know? I hope I didn't close island.org. No, I didn't. Alright. Next one will be... Number nine, carrot dude. Unfortunately, I cannot take you, so I'm actually gonna have to skip you right now since I already have one, which was the guaranteed two, and this next one has to be just filled in. So I'm not gonna keep doing this because I'm pretty sure a couple of you guys picked classes that I can't even unlock yet. So unfortunately, carrot dude, you are out for now. Next will be number eight. Are you really random? A female warrior apprentice, Lunar... Oh, Lunar Shadows is in this. Oh, great. Alright, let me see. Lunar Shadows, what did you want? Something with defense. As far as I know, that's a rock. Because this gives me less of... A rock. A female warrior apprentice. So, if this is a male warrior, this is the female warrior. Alright. And you want it to be called Lunar. Alright, Lunar... I, I remember I couldn't find the R. Alright. You said you need defense, so... She'll be the tank. Because she wanted defense, she's going to be the tank. Somehow I don't see that as an actual girl right there, but you know what? It's a game. The game is meant to have fun. All those things and things. And things. Alright, so... Let's start. The moment I can, I will make you a pretty or female swordsman. Whichever one comes first, honestly. We got two people, though. Let me now mark you guys as made. Alright. Good, now you know how to make custom characters. You can make more if you want to. Now let's move on. That far from the sky. Approach the shop and press X button to buy and sell items. You can also buy from the merchant. You can equip the items you bought by accessing the equip arrange menu. Objects on the ground are equipable. So try them out. Wait, really? Oh, great, they're gonna give me a trophy for shopping as well. Level of the merchant will affect item quality. May I help you? This is the vending machine with some items. Buy weapon, what do we have? 
Wait, we can pick nunchucks as weapons? So, axes, nunchucks, spears, rapiers, a U books? A dictionary, nice. A UFO. How is this a weapon? I want to know, actually. You guys didn't give me any preference on what weapons you wanted, but let me quickly check what weapons you, actually, you guys are actually good with. Lunar, dagger, sword, rapier, spear. I might end up giving you a spear, quite honestly. Unreaper, you are another deck. Wait, you can do the UFO? Oh god, I'm giving you a UFO. Or maybe a fishing pole, who knows. I've never seen a UFO weapon, so I am beyond tempted to see how one uses the UFO as a weapon. Smokey, what do you got? Sword, Morning Star, Spear, Axe. I'll probably give you a sword. Standard things, I guess. Saber, Longsword. We actually have a bit of health, but I'm going to be conservative right now with what I'm going to buy. I'm going to get a Saber. Remember, I said I'd get someone a spear. And there's the UFO. Wait, you can use a special thief technique. Mm, now that I think about it. You can use a rifle, a rapier, and dagger. Thieves use daggers, I guess. Until I see the UFO in battle, I'm kind of skeptic to even buy it. It costs 90, but let me give you a dagger then. I don't know why I went up and then back down again. Dagger? No, we're gonna give you the second tier. Let's equip them right now. Smoky. Saber. You. Unreaper. Getting the knife. And Lunar. You're getting a spear. Though you did want defense, so... A rock. Wait, actually, I don't... No, it doesn't even give you any defense at all anyway, so meh. What about equipment? What do we have in this sort of thing? Equipment? Very comfortable. Here, touch it! Swept away in the eternal fabric stream. Traveler's shield, wooden helmet, a hat. For some reason, I thought this was a taco. I have no idea why. All the choices. And as far as I'm aware, I see n minimal difference right now, because it is early in the game, I guess, so... Still play cost way too much. I'll leave all that for now, at the moment. I'm very plain like that. No, we're not skipping the demo! What do you take us for? We need, a, we need a new netherworld to be created, but we won't ask Pram. You never know what she'll do with us, do to us. So we'll ask Mickey instead. Alright, what does he do? Whoa! <laughs> That's harder than it looks, so... <laughs> It took some of my power as soon as I wrote down my wish. I see. Each wish has a price. I assume it depends on the size of your wish. Something huge like rebuilding a netherworld would probably erase a basic demon. Which means only an overlord could create a netherworld. How will you compensate us for the trouble we've gone through to help? <laughs> Money! Babes! Alcohol! <laughs> Can't you just calm down? Lord Zed is in trouble and we need to help him, okay? Okay, Zeta, you can go to the new netherworld now. Yeah, thanks. You're not a bad guy, Mickey. But that's why you'll never be a great overlord.
We will travel to the other netherworld through this Makai gate. First the gate and press the X button to select your destination. Anything can happen, so don't forget to save before taking off. Thank god, I actually was about to say I should save up, but no. Instead, that one just started. Yeah! Saving. There we go. Let's see what the new world has to offer us. The Mokai Gate has been activated. To Overlord Dungeon to Free Dungeon? Well, we can't go to one, so we must go to the other. Stage 1, Beginner's Lounge. Let's see. Meet Mickey. We don't have to fight him, right? Not skipping the demo either. Thanks a lot, Mickey. Sucker. <laughs> Why'd you wuss out like that? Are you afraid of Zeta or something? That was the perfect chance to have a little fun. Are you sure you're the Dark Lord? Uh, of course I am. Leave Mickey alone, you bitch. The only people who get to bully Mickey are myself and... The Ryzen picks on Mickey! <laughs> Whatever, I'm sick of you guys anyway. Don't get so bent out of shape, Fram. I played a trick of my own. We'll have our fun, don't worry. Huh? What'd you do? Well... What the hell kind of netherworld is this? Nobody said anything about enemies! Alright, tutorial invite. You need to summon characters to fight. See the cursor on them on on me. Set the cursor on oh, wow, I can't even read. Set the cursor on me and press the X button to open the invite command. Select invite to summon friendly units on the battlefield. And they fall from the sky. The number of units you can summon is restricted. Check the population, POP. The number on the right represents the total number of units you can summon. The number on the left represents the number of units on the field. If your unit is defeated during the battle, the number on the right will decrease. Reach zero and it's game over. Oh boy. You can summon all at once or summon little by little. It's your choice. How to clear the stage? Check out the score on the bottom right of the screen. The number on the right represents the total stage required to clear the stage. You can you can collect stage points by defeating your enemies. This map requires 200 points to clear. You can receive a total of 400 here. Therefore, if you defeat 200 worth, 200 worth of enemies, worth points worth of enemies, you can clear the stage. D100, 300. All right. Who can we bring out? I don't I don't wanna that I usually do. Orbital cannon! Orbital friend drop. I usually want them to come to us. Cause I don't wanna try to intrude over there and have them gang up on anyone individually. And there's something to be said just about being able to drop everyone, just like fall. Seems kinda awesome. Also, I don't even know what kind of attack you guys have. 
So you have a cone. You have a little slash right there. You also have a little slash right there. Come at us! Just don't go at one person individually. Ready. Oh god, they can walk. Ready. Okay. Okay, no, 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 Oh, ain't that bad. Ah. So they all went after one guy. Can we just... Alright. I'm gonna try to kill the small ones first. Let's see. Oh dear god, this is gonna suck. This is gonna suck. Ready? Wait, what? Why are you on top of your friend? Does that mean I can hit you both? I'm gonna kill you first. Try to hit you, but oh great! Please get off of your friend. I want to be able to get full points. Yeah. Oh god. No. Bad. Wait, you have a hat? I kind of want that hat. I also want your broadsword, but I doubt I'm gonna be able to get. But man, anyways. Ah, on top of you. Oh, come on. This could be a tad bit interesting. Leave her alone! Come on! Yeah! Now we can try and kill her. Or this dude. Don't you dare hit Zeta. Yeah! Safe cleared. Hospital. 30 health. 30 health. More experience. Out of a thousand! How do you get a thousand? We got nothing. Good job, we've acquired a hospital. And it too gets the same treatment of falling from the sky. Heal the wounded at the hospital. You can also heal with the healer. Approach the hospital and press the X button to access the hospital. You need money to heal, but you better do it just in case. Alright, time to go heal up, because one guy unfortunately just got ganged up on. Incapacitated, I'm sorry. Just rest up. Rest up, you're kind of in need. Gonna save up now, so I don't have to do that again. Yeah! Save. What do you have us do now, Zeta? What do you want? Oh, fine. Let's see what the next place is. Mickey Celebration. Let's try this one. We get a demo too? Awesome. Oh great, it's not actually a demo, it's just a tutorial. Did you know you can lift objects up and throw them during battle? Destroying lift and throws. Lift and throw is one of the most important tactics in this game. Come on, Smokey. You can use lift if the character is not holding anything. Select lift and choose the object which carry. You can carry either an object or a character. Don't forget. You can take the item you're holding back to the kingdom, if you beat the stage while holding it. Next, how to throw. Strategically throw items and characters to your benefit during battle. Remember, you can't 
You can't lift and throw while you are holding something. So you have to unequip the character first. And that generated points? Or score then. If you're holding something, go to the item menu and unequip the item. You can also equip an item by, by approaching it and pressing the X button. It's the easiest way to get extra items during the game. Oh, I forgot to tell you something important! Extension. Usually when you throw an item off the map, it becomes OB. OB. Oh, the poor man! Oh my god. Now, depending on where you throw the item, an expansion, an extra hidden map called Extension will appear. Extensions will also appear by defeating or destroying key items and characters. Extension maps can be used to train the army. And the more extension maps you find, the stronger the enemy becomes, so watch out. Alright, get the extension. Oh, you can actually see it just by mousing over it, or putting your analog around the character next to it. And it tells you what's key. <gasps> Rock! Wait, 33 defense? Um... Defense girl, you want that rock, I'm sure you do. We're gonna have to beat the stage with it, though. We'll leave that for later right now, for when we're done. Spread everyone far apart so they do not gang up on anyone. And they can still walk ages. Nothing. And that's my phone, actually. I got him a text message! What is it? This text message says okay. Alright. That's good. Multi-ray thingy. Let's see, can we actually get everyone in on this? Find the pixel that makes it work? Uh, theoretically, no, I guess so. Sticking with that. On Reaper, we calling you to the battlefield. Gonna try to all get one person. You can get him. Let's see how that does. Oh, it's gonna be a pain. I level you up. I can already tell. And, yeah, it only goes to the person who does the last hit, too, so, ah. Uh... Ready. No, Ready. don't hurt him! What? Score bonus, you can't invite anymore. Okay, so... If they even mess with Zeta, apparently things can go south. Can I go after both of you guys? Technically, I'm pretty sure I can. Just gotta find the pixel for it. There it is! Great. Well, this is gonna become a bit difficult. Probably should've made another character. Not gonna lie. How's this? We do want her to level up. We do want other people to level up aside Smokey, so... Actually, you are already level 2, so... Oh god, I don't want to hit Zeta! Oh, that works. Another rock! Actually, I'm not even going to bother trying to go over there. You come to us. That's the pumpkin? Yeah, it's pumpkin people. Pumpkins. We're gonna have to try and get focus fire them down. 
Wait, Sonic Charge? We got something new. Let's see how this goes. Nice. Okay, we're actually close together, so... But they can't do anything! So, ha! Smoker, do you have a special attack now? Ooh, Berserk! Oh, it's only around us, though. But can that do some damage for us? Ready. Oh, that thing. I kind of want to do take something back, so... Let's see. That only gives us three defense, so of course I don't want that. We want the rock. You've captured this map already. Keep the death count rising! Thank god there's no counters, so I don't have to worry about that. Got it. Wait, does that mean that we can flower? I'm ignoring you for a moment. You're not exactly that important, so. Joink! Yep, 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 yep. Look at him try. Anything else over here that I can pick up? The rock's not exactly worth it. We found him that gives 33. One and one. Uh, let me see. Fine. We got shoes! And that's it. And a flat rock! And a small flower. No skipping the demo either. So that's your little trick? Hmm. I guess this might prove amusing at best. Where there is good, there is also bad, correct? It's important to have balance. Oh, no! How could you all feel it up? Now Zeta will be angry. How dare you do this to me? So let him be angry. Jeez. You're the Dark Lord, aren't you? Throw a pair. You're practically shaking at the thought of Lord Zeta. Shut up! You're a newbie overlord anyway. <laughs> Is that all you've got? I'm supposed to submit to you just because you're older? Mana power is all that matters. I can show you if you want. Oh, all right, ma'am, forget it. You're more powerful than I am. <laughs> Glad to hear it. 